Hey, what's up everyone? It's your friend 23 here and welcome back to a new episode of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, in the last episode we finished uh, the episode by finding some great skeleton here and putting the eyeball in for a girl who wanted to see this this fossil with, with the eyeballs. And now it's sounding like uh, Blood Moon is approaching. Bef but before that happens, today I was feeling really curious about this this storm th here so so I'm, I'm thinking today we're gonna today we're gonna go and uh, check that out and the easiest way I'm guessing is via the starting island and then just flying over there And also while we're here, I'm just gonna check if I have any crystallized charges. I think I have some. Yeah. A lot actually. So that one extra battery, which is nice. Six full and one extra. That's nice. Let's let the blood moon come. We get over get it over with. Maybe a bit overkill <laughs> using this weapon on, on the churches. But who cares? Okay, so from here, if we want to reach the storm, we're actually not that far away from it. Maybe we want to like land on some of these on the way. That one is also really cool looking. I wonder if that's like a Colosseum, maybe? Like one of these things? Uh, where am I? One of these ones. Okay, so here I'm guessing the easiest way is to build just a flying car, as usual. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, the storm is really far down. Is that a sky island? And that's actually the starter, <laughs> starter sky island, of course. I knew that. Okay, so how far have we gone? Almost nowhere. I'm starting to approach one island right beneath us now. How come I don't see it? Is it really far down, maybe? It's not above us. No, no, no. Ah, it's down there, I think. I think I see it. Let's drop down some height here. Oops. I dropped the car. 
Oh my, it's so far down this guy island. I think we're able to glide in here now. Into the storm. I think I saw a platform to the right here. Thunderhead Isles. Oh my god. This is like zero vision here. <laughs> okay, so what do I need to make this more visible for me? Can I even do anything? I don't think Bright Bloom Seeds will do anything. Nope. Maybe a little, but not... Not enough, though. So am I for real supposed to find stuff in this bad... <laughs> like, I can't see anything at all? I'm just free falling here. <sighs> I feel like I'm missing some piece of information. Because it can't supposed to be that you should be in that storm and <laughs> find, find where you're going from it. So that's... I had like zero vision there. So what is this? Just ahead. Okay, so the storm is cloudy as hell. Hard to see anything. So maybe we have to think Rethink this episode's goal instead. This island right here. I wonder if... I'm back to the Giga thinking now. It might be that the Giga is having a thing there. But then I wonder if you need to approach it from... From the woods or from the outside? That's the question. I guess going here we can glide on the side and, and just see if we can reach it. Otherwise we have to go through through the through the forest. Okay. I think we can no, 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 look. This, um... We can reach the island from the outside here. Let's glide a bit more.
have one enemy. Wow. That hit, huh? Wow. Didn't have any sword out. Uh, okay. Come on, this can couldn't be it, huh? Only one chest and one enemy on this island. Nice spear though, I guess, but oh. I don't know what I wanna drop. Is that legit everything of value on this little island? <laughs> I guess so. I will not probably build my flying machine here. Before we go into the forest again, I'm just gonna check the outside here if... Because it might be here, actually. Somewhere. Oh, here's an enemy I wanna fight, though. So let's do that for now. Good morning. Oh, no, not this, not this, not this. Use this, why not? I think I might one-shot this dude. Maybe not. Now it's GG though. If I can stop hitting his armor. Wow, that's good loot. This breaks soon, so why not actually drop it? And then we need the bow also. And I'll drop it from for one of those. Oh. I picked up the thing I dropped. Also, Royal Sword is nice. Perhaps don't want to drop anything. I want to drop that. Let's do the claymore. These Kurokos, these stones here. What is this? Oh, wait. Isn't this the. Oh my god, it's a lot of stones here. Okay, damn. Good thing we didn't go into the woods. Okay, okay. We finally progress a bit here. Oh my god, it's an active cave also. We're gonna probably start with some sneak gear. Uh, if I can find it. Oh. <laughs> Who's there? I'm here, you're Link. Come to free our tailor, have you? Yep. You'll have to get through us first. Okay. Oh. Oh. He gets headshot then. You 
should probably also change armor to something that doesn't take as much damage. These are free money if you sell them. You get two each. Nice with some arrows and some. I really enjoy in this game compared to Breath of the Wild, like the amount of arrows you accumulate. It's almost impossible to run out. At least this late in the game. I guess we we'll keep on going here. Any any more enemies? <laughs> Let's read this. Read the clan. Uh, this cave is a natural fortress made up of five cham chambers. All members are to memorize the route to the hidden room, containing our uniforms and the map of all branches. Ooh, remember, follow the eyes of the frogs. The punishment for letting this secret out will be most severe. Severe. Okay, so follow the eyes of the frogs, huh? I'm guessing you shouldn't ascend here. Uh, this is probably wrong. I just wanna double check. Yeah. Okay, so the follow frog where frog look. They are looking that way, which makes sense. Isn't that frog looking the other way? Maybe we should just follow though. Oh. This was only... This was just... Okay. But here I see something. Okay. Yeah. So the question is, you should ascend here, probably. Like here. Yeah, oh. That's it, huh? Tee will he come? Finally, I've been waiting. It's pretty. If a pretty lady is in distress, the hero will arrive to save her. Everyone says so. So this is en entirely expected. Yeah, but the... That's strange. Uh, the hero is supposed to be carry a legendary sword. And that weapon on your back, it doesn't look legendary at all. Not even when I squint. I guess the hero is just a fairy tale. Me? I've been making outfits for the Giga clan since they kidnapped me. I mean, I like fashion, but I couldn't even s sue. Did they listen? No, of course not. It wasn't so bad once I got used to it though. Honestly, I've been getting a little attached to the outfits I make. Attach enough that I don't want to hand them over to the Giga clan anyways. This isn't my size, but it might fit you here. Here, take it, so I can keep it out of their grimy mitts. Nice. Oh, uh, Tihi, careful folks. Uh, we'll think you're a part of the Giga clan if you wear the complete set. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Because I need to get inside their main base. Okay, so we found... Like, now we've been up here, and we've been here, because that's where we are now, and we've found both pieces of cloth, and it's this part we want to get access to. But that means that the last part must be where we were last time. At the, like, old start-out place. 
So let me, I guess, quick travel here and we will try to find the piece. The last piece, that is. Right in the sludge again. Okay, I'm not able to get up from that sludge. Here it should be safe. Oh, for reals. That's annoying. I guess I deserve that. Let me be and just ascend. Please. And not in the sludge. Thank you. Okay, now we have enough for a car. Last time we were here, we didn't have it. Which made the... Uh, exploring a bit more tedious. I think I'm gonna go on the outskirt because if, if we're looking at the picture, we have looked at it a lot of times. I was I was gonna say it looks like it's on the outskirt, but actually it looks like yes, it's just in the center here. Oops, sorry. So what I'm searching for now is like something that looks a bit sus. But I'm not sure what it is. What is that thing also? That's just a thing in the wall, huh? We should check this house. Ah, oh, shit. As if it's... It really looks like closed off from the public. With all these spikes. So I'm a bit... Yeah, this is also a Giga place. Who's there? Wait, you. Your link. Thought you ambushed us, did you? Well, you're the one getting it today. <laughs> I... Somehow I have a hard time... ...thinking I'm the one losing this fight. <laughs> or maybe I am. <laughs> well, if I keep fighting like that, I'm certainly gonna lose. so much unnecessary damage. There we go, huh? The last piece. Wait, you're not one of them. You chased off the Giga clan? You mean I can get out of here? Hooray! Those Giga guys were forcing me to make weird outfits for them. It was awful. Why me? Your guess is as good as mine. Maybe because of my reputation for the flashy fashion. I only let CC brand thread touch my body. Hmm, I don't want this mask to fall into the, their hand. But I can't bring it with me. So would you take this? Gladly. Oh. I just ignore, ignored what he said there in the end. <laughs> Read the clan journal. The Yiga bulletin. Confidential updates from the hideout. Item 1. Our research division has developed new vehicles. Okay. If one of the vehicles is damaged, please contact the members of the research division in the depths right away. Item 2. It is 
imperative that all espionage against in the field learn of the earthquake technique. Adem addendum. The earthquake technique can only be learned at the hideout's training area. So I'm guessing that's where we're going now. Is the car gone? No. Good. Was there a cave entrance down here? Or was it only enemies? The hell is this thing? Part of me really wanna fight these dudes. <laughs> I guess we're gonna wake them up with a nice little explosion in the middle. Then after that, maybe actually a muddle bud on the big dude. So he can help me with the small ones here. Ooh, they carry apples. That's nice. Actually, this is a uh, Kuroko, huh? That's good. Now it's only me and the big dudes left here. Need a shield also. Oh, I'm so bad at parrying. That's why I'm training, because soon we need to start fighting Lynels. And they... You need to know how to parry with for. Oh my god. Do it again, please. Oh. I don't remember what I fused my Master Sword with to get this fire effect. We did a Talus Heart. Yeah, that's correct. Now I remember. Actually, pretty good damage on that Monster Sword right now. Ooh, we need this. And we also. Are you not gone? I hope it was worth it. Okay, so let's ascend this for the Kuroko. And then we're going to the last hideout. Oh. Is it worth going by car? No. And also, where was that hideout? Is it this thing? I think it's this thing, actually. I remember I found the hideout while I was going in the walls or near the walls here. So, so I guess we're gonna go here and just glide down. This this dude. This is interesting. What are you painting? This gets more fascinating the more I look at it. It seems the shape holds some special meaning. Hmm. Oh, I was so engrossed in my work that I didn't even realize I had a fellow traveler to con converse with. In case you couldn't tell, I'm a painter. I travel the world in search for beautiful sights. These mysterious floating islands are only the most recent to catch my eyes. I was just painting the small island there as a matter of fact. Granted, you can see it very well when the clouds are in the way. Ever since the upheaval, the sky has been filled with floating islands. But none has caught my fancy so much as the exquisitely shaped one over there. I can't quite explain it, but it feels as though it's speaking to me somehow. I guess that's the one we take pictures on, huh? Why are the floating islands up there? It can't hurt to take a little time out of your day to stop and think about it. That island is where? If we're... It was that one, no? It 
was that one, right? Yeah. That's just one of those. Okay, and we're thinking of going down this way. So if I remember correctly, it was at the bridge. And if I remember correctly, it was close to the waterfall here. And we also actually, didn't we... Didn't we unlock a shrine that was just... At their base? I have a vague memory of that. Let's just check the picture again. It looks more to the left, actually. Oh well, let's go here just and see if, if I'm remembering correctly, otherwise we have to backtrack a bit. I remember the cave, because I thought the uh, thing was in the game. Yeah, it's here, it's here. Nice. Oh, then we need to put on the cloth also before we knock. Now I'm 100% giga. I was like, do I have any giga swords? I don't. Maybe that works. I have nothing to say to those of the not to those not of the giga. Don't I have full giga on? I forgot the middle piece. There, sorry, sorry. I am full Giga. <laughs> you Giga clan, huh? Alright, come in. Yeah, I just forgot my middle piece here. Finally. This only took us like 80 episodes to figure out. What up, dude? So there's no one capable. This is the Giga Blade Master Station. It is where Giga Blade Monsters are made and unmade. You braved elements to take this first step. That speaks well of your passion to become the Blade Monster. Mm? But my exam is more rigorous, rigorous still. Do you have it w within you to succeed? Will you try and give it your all? Mm? I'll do it. Oh, wonderful. Well done. Listen closely to my words. The test is unforgiving. This is what you must do. In Gerudo Canyon, there are five frog statues with the identity marks of the Giga clan. I will reveal the locations. Thank you. Oh. What you must do is travel to the five frogs and make an offering of mighty bananas to each one. That we should be able to do. This harsh land will lash your mercilessly in with its cold and heat. Your travel may prove your end, but if you succeed, I will name you Blade Master. Furthermore, I will personally give you these mighty bananas. Thank you. I have no more bananas to give for now. If you need more, a true blade monster is expected to find their own. Now let the test begin. So I guess I can't go in here in beforehand. Nope. Yes, yes, I will do the exam for you then. If that is what you ask for, from me. So the first one should be here. Probably underneath us. If I would take a guess. Yep. I heard you crave the banana. So here you go, my dude. And then... We got my build famous car <laughs> as always and up we go I think we're gonna take this like a circle so we start with the one to the left here that was really far though
shrine below me. The hell is all those things also down there? Oh, time to land. Ooh, I see something I really need. We'll just park here for now. Really need some aimbot eyes. There we go. Oh my god. That's far down though. Freaking hell. I guess we don't take the aimbot eyes. It's not worth the climb up again. Okay, so it says that we're straight on it, so I guess maybe it's up here. And there's the dragon also. So it's not here, then it means it has to be underneath us. Then I wonder, is it a cave behind the waterfall maybe? Also I see a gumball machine over there. Let's go for it to it first. I will try to park the car. There we go. Let's see what this gives us. Springs, that's nice. And big wheels, that's actually good because they go hand in hand with each other. So that's actually really nice. And we still haven't gotten everything. So let's do one more. Did we get everything from here now? Still not. <laughs> Is it batteries? That's the missing piece. No portable pots. Okay. Don't make the car fall down though. I say as I'm letting it slide out of my hands. But it was a nice catch. <laughs> I just wanna see if they have any quests for me over here. Looks like a place that can can have some quests for me. Do you have any quests? Evening. Are you headed to Gerudo Canyon? Just know that you're... After you cross, cross the bridge, the guard up ahead is gonna give you a test. That's right, all the questions are about how to deal with hot and cold weather. But no matter how many times I try, I can't seem to pass. Okay. Are you needing help? Fascinating. It's a little chilly. Oh. oh. Might you be a traveler? I'm camping here so I can investigate the giant ruins that fell at the entrance to the Gerudo Canyon just head up ahead. Giant ruins? Oh. Pebbles and ruins have been falling all over since the upheaval. Oh. Okay. This is nothing of value for us right now. Because we already know everything about that. I will just loot some of your supplies here, if it's okay. <laughs> By all of you guys. Here also. Wow. Okay, 
Here, off we go again. Oh, look. It's an entrance here. That's cool. Freaking hell. Not the easiest place to navigate the car. But maybe we can just... If we put the car here. Maybe it can just stay there for a while. Why not just use the monster sword here? Bubble gems are we up to 13. It's starting to be time to also go and pay a visit to that dude also. The one selling things for those bubble frog frog thingies. Ooh, diamond. Very very nice. Don't you try. Here you are. I heard you wanted a banana. do my best here to drive the car out to the other side here. Oh my god. I need... No, this is like the worst thing that could have happened. Maybe not, actually. I didn't think it would load. Just let it be in the water for a quick second while we get this sweet loot. No, that's that's not good. Not the easiest thing to start here. Let's just jump up to this. I think the problem is we need to turn this thing. I think that will be enough. Now we can do a quick little turn. And then down. And then up. There we go. You need your friend. Where is that said friend? Yeah. That we can do. That's not that far. Please just find that goddamn shrine also that's here. I'm hearing like the beeps. No 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 I tried to turn. I see it. Ah There we go. The hover bike is off. Sh 
shrine quest, it seems. No, 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 no. You stay with me. Stay there. I... I think it's gonna be up in the sky somewhere. Okay, no. But is it far though? But actually we have this as a quick travel point now, so we can just leave it, let it be for now. Oh. Nice. That means that this thing we can delete. What up dudes? That's a cave that we've been in. Yeah, this this place says was really spread out. It's a dragon, I see. That's a Talus, maybe. That stone looked a bit sus. Here it is. This is also a Talos fight scene, I think it is. Uh, banana, banana. There we go. One banana for you. And a uh, stone fight for me. Ah, oh, damn. Should also change uh, gear, maybe. Maybe we don't need to. This is going quickly. That hurt. We, it's a rare stone talus, huh? Those we need to snap a pick on. Oh, I thought you threw your hand on me. What you gonna do? Jeez. I really liked uh, like how easy this fight was for the amount of loot we got. I'm probably gonna do that. And we're gonna put... Why not put this on that one? I really wanna fight that dragon also. Gonna check for a Kuroko seed or something on the top here. Might actually be something here. Put a pin on that fight also, I wanna do it sometime. Oh. Yeah, you could call it food if you want, but I would call it a fight more. Uh, 
Okay, behind us. What the hell is that thing? That looks cool. Gonna... Places I wanna, like, explore, I'm gonna do a star on. We should just drop straight down. Okay. I'm guessing that this is inside some type of cave then. Because it's not here. Where could an entrance to the cave be? That's a good question. Either on this side or the other, I would guess. Nothing here so far. I see it, I see it. Nice. Oh. It's okay. <laughs> nice. It's just planned. Let's leave the car outside. Couldn't hear hear me from that thing. Gonna sneak over to this side. Ooh, that almost tipped over. <laughs> Yoi. I think I only hit one of them, huh? One more. Nice. have time what? oh nice good job to Lin with the bomb barrel uh, refill there. Damn, that was good. Not good, that was really bad loot. Because that was a rare ore deposit and we got one amber from it. A bit unfortunate. Okay. Yes, the platform is up here. Oh. Small dudes. And also you. <laughs> Can I eat me? Thought I had time shooting an arrow there. Stole my hammer. Oh, 
Or how long are you gonna eat it? Is it good? Oh my god, are you for real? That's not good. There we go. Also, if this is a cave, one of those Bokolobin frogs, not Bokolobin, bubble frogs should exist. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Also a bad rare or deposit. There is the frog. The hell is this shield only drop? Uh, I hope the aimbot will reach. That it. Oh, <laughs> should also do what we came here from for, of course. My bad. Banana. <laughs> so I just got my back, which feels good. Give me the aim button. If you if you insist on attacking me, I can I can take some ice. It's okay. I don't mind. Ooh, we almost missed this also. Damn. Yeah, if I would have missed that, it would made me have made me sad. Or not really, because I wouldn't have known that I missed it. But you know what I mean. And hopefully the car is still here. Please? I don't think so. Nope. That's sad. So how far is the last one? That one we probably can just glide from here too. Yeah, that was the one I th thought was down there, maybe. Uh, need some heat resistance. Hope it's done enough. Okay, so now we're above it. Is it something with this sand thing to do? No. But here the platform is at least. That's good. And one more banana. Oh my god. Ni nice throw. <laughs> one more banana. And put it there. Nice. The exam is done. Now we're going there again, huh? Oh... I'm curious about this. That was <laughs> nothing. I think by going here we should be able to reach the waterfall. And 
switch back to Yiga. You're Yiga clan? Of course I am, 100%. Looking at the time, the continuance on this uh, Giga Clan questline will have to wait for tomorrow's episode. If you have enjoyed watching this episode, please consider leaving a like on the video. It helps me a lot. Also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. This has been 23. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.